ladies and gentlemen, my name is Smojo, and welcome back to another video, my friends. Today, we're going to be talking about how overpowered is Santa Water, if it is overpowered, and should this be an item that you should go for inside of Vampire Survivors, or is it just trash? That's what we're going to be talking about today. Let's go ahead and get started. If you guys are unfamiliar with what Santa Water is, Santa Water rains down bottles of holy water from the sky, which breaks upon impact with the ground, leaving puddles of water that damages enemies. Now, in my personal opinion, I feel like Santa Water is really, really good. I'm gonna show some gameplay on the screen here. I think Santa Water is is a really, really good weapon for the fact that it stays on the ground, it damages over time, it pierces enemies. It, it pretty much does everything you want a projectile or a, a weapon to do, except actually go for enemies, which a lot of other projectiles do. Even with that being said, Santa Water is actually really, really, really 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 a good weapon especially for late game in my personal opinion especially when you evolve it if you guys don't know how to involve uh santa water you're gonna need to have the passive perk of the magnet the magnet pretty much increases the item pickup range for your character if you combine this with the santa water then it'll evolve into a new weapon that is called labora now labora is pretty much the exact same thing as santa water except it brings in the bottles or the pools of holy water Water towards your character so essentially if you have a bunch of passives that complement santa water and you just stand still inside of a and, and just stand still you'll notice a uh, just a circle of holy water within your feet that it will kill anything that steps foot in it period now i did a little run myself which i actually did beat the game and my whole goal was to use santa water or labora as my main damage dealing type of uh weapon unfortunately i didn't get all the passives that i wanted i wanted to get at least another one which was the tomb the empty tomb to reduce the cooldown which would have made this so much better but even so this still did a lot of damage and i actually beat the game with using nothing but santa water of course i had to pick up other extra items because the game just wants me to but santa water did do the most amount of damage and dps for that game as you can see on the screen now so yeah in my opinion i feel like labor or santa water is a top tier item inside of uh, vampire survivors a lot of people don't like it that much because other weapons outshine it because they kill faster or whatnot and then when you look at the end screen it's like santa water didn't have that much dps because everything else had much dps but if you just give santa water a little bit of time to shine you'll really notice how great of an item that it is that does 7.5k damage per second and the main reason being is the endless stacks of santa water on your character if any enemy step in that it's just boom 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 damage per second bro seven thousand that's a lot of damage every single second in fact i'm going to be bold and say that santa water evolution is top three most damage dealing items in the entire game it's either gonna have the most damage or the most dps depending on what you choose you know what i mean i'm gonna go ahead and say it and i'm gonna i'm gonna I'm stick behind it top three most damage dealing items in the game is santa water to be more specific it's labor but yeah, from what you've heard, what you've seen, let me know what you guys think down below in the comments. It would be amazing to know what you think about Santa Water or Labor. And if you want more information on any of these items inside of Vampire Survivors, I have a fan Discord server with endless amounts of information about this game. If you guys are interested in that, links will be down in the description. So please check it out. But yeah, let me know what you think. Let me definitely let me let me know what you think about Labor or Santa Water of Vampire Survivors. I appreciate you guys watching. Have a good morning, evening, and afternoon. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.